Well, welcome to the channel and today is going to be a battle report I'm, my daughter's going to take my space walls uh, against my orcs so it's going to be a saga of a beast uh, you know, going to try a few bits out for the walls from saga of a beast uh, my orcs I'm only using the uh, Grok specialist mob Grok one uh, cheeky zoggers I think it is but that, that's the only one on the orc side I'll be trying out uh, because I've got no vehicles or, or bits and pieces that I, I want to use there uh, it's going to be an eternal war mission uh, crusade it's 2k points and we rolled number one on the map which I believe is frontline assault the uh, spear the spearhead would be hammer and anvil would be diablo uh, on it uh coming right up will be the army lists the uh, objectives were placed pre pre-map and pre uh placing of the terrain and i placed three over there and my daughter's placed her through that side we then placed the terrain and then rolled for map and that's how, how, how it ended up looking i'll come back for army list later yeah. well, it's a nice day to, today so i thought i'd record the army lists outside now the space walls is a double battalion. Uh, first detachment is going to be Ulrich and Ragnar. I've got an old Ragnar model. Uh, he's lost his sword, but uh, I've got him. And then I've got a 10 man intercessor bolt with right, bolt with rifles in it and two units of five blood claws, pistols and chainsaws. Uh, uh, then I have a unit of Fenry, 10th in the region was the Thunder Wolf Cavalry and the three man interceptor squad and a A squad of eliminators. Now, mass battalion, second battalion has Arjak Rockfist. It has uh, a rune priest uh, with jump pack. It's got the armor of rust and. It's really, well, it's really good. And uh, put one five man blood squad, two units of five man eliminated uh, infant traitors. And then it's got a five man unit of. Uh, Terminators, three, three with thunder claws, uh, thunder hammers and shields, two with lightning claws. Uh, the a unit of suppressors, a u, six man unit of wolfing, five with claws, the leader's got wolf, the frost claws. That's it. I don't think there's anything else in that list, uh, and that comes to around about 2,000 points. It's not. I think it's just under 1998, if I'm uh, if I'm correct, if I'm uh, if I'm right. But the idea for her is to get all those melee units to, in late, late turn, jump jump down and and claim objective she won the uh, she lost the um map so she's going to deploy first and then she'll decide whether she goes first or not uh 
as it's the start of the second battle round, you start scoring points, you may go first. Uh, whereas if it was at the end of the battle, battle round, she'd probably want to go second. Uh, and, and the idea for her will be to clear my units off, off while, while scoring from her own and try and outscore me that way. Uh, for me, my my list is pretty simple. It's a war boss and a weird boy. Four units of boys, uh, three lots of uh, 30 man squads, uh, two, two of the knots have got power claws in, in those, and a unit of 11 and he's got the knots just standard load, load out. I, I then have a bad moons unit, Sorry, the first one was single suns, second new, uh, detachment is uh, bad moons. Uh, it's got my two shock attack mechs in there, uh, one with the uh, relic one. Uh, the three units of Gretchen, one, two lots of 20 man units and one 10 man unit uh, of Gretchen. Uh, then the looters. Uh, the war, war boss in the Eagle Sons detachment's got the, the killer claw relic, and, and then we go into the third detachment, and that's the uh, specialist mob. Got a specialist mob, uh, cheeky zoggers, I think it's called. Anyway, that's got a big mech. In Mega Armor with Custom Force Field and got, uh, got Oiler there, a company in him, a Weird Boy, that's the HQ, three un units of 10 man rocks. Then I've got two units with, uh, of mech guns, four, four lots of smashing guns in each of those, so that's eight smashing guns in total. Uh, for me, all I'm going to be doing is sort of trying to stop Jasmine's melee stuff, the, the Terminators getting in behind and her do, doing damage on my smasher guns and, uh, and such, and then also trying to stop Uh, remove her from the objectives if I can. I mean, my boys aren't going to do anything against the Wolf and the, or the uh, Terminators or the Thunder Wolf cavalry, really. So I'm going to be relying on my my shooting. It'd be smites and, and my the shock attack gun that doesn't. Yeah, that's like that, that, that level to get the uh, uh, mortal wound out sort of through them, and that'll be the way I'll be trying to get rid of the wolf and, and the uh, thunder wolf cavalry straight up. And then, of course, she'll be dropping in turn two or three, depending on how, for, how to uh, get the terminators in. And of course, they're going to. They have been vulnerable, so, so they're going to be uh, pain to, to remove as well. So it's going to go, I think it's going to be quite an interesting battle. You're going to have orcs, uh, and basically, I'm, I'm thinking my, my boys aren't going to. They might go to melee to top, to slow things down and sort of slow her down and uh, and allow me to keep ball control and keep scoring but I'm, I'm really yet just looking to shoot her off the board 
and she's going, going to, you know, she's got some decent shooting there and she'll thin my hordes and push me back so so it's going to be quite an interesting battle uh, I, I should start to run out of steam around about turn five but i'm hoping to to sort of uh, myself ahead. What, what, I, what I'm looking at is hopefully shoot what is that if I that I'll, I'll seize the initiative and then that that's uh, gonna give me a, a slight edge but if not I'm going to weather the storm turn one and then put her on and see what I I can do to give myself a chance in the game. Uh, Blood Course stayed where, where they were, the Lemon Sage just stayed where they were, the infiltrators moved up a little, the uh, Inceptors moved. The incurs the suppressors didn't. Everything else, uh, the wolf and the thunder wolf gathering and the Ben Wisdom wolves moved. So did Olwick Rune Priest and Ragnar. And the Primaris Marines moved up. They're going to be, be using two stratagems from the Saga of a Wolf. Beast in the shooting phase, which will be one that means they are uh, counted as having remained stationary, and the one that puts their weapons to rapid fire two with bolter discipline means that's rapid fire four. That's forty shots for them going into the orcs, which should be quite devastating. Uh, the rune priest will use cloak by the storm stratagem in the psychic phase. And that will give everything within six inches of him cover. Uh, the uh, storm, living storm, which get, get, makes everything in six inches of him minus one to hit, that is, is the psychic power he's going to be using. So they're going to be, be everything here will be minus one to hit and have plus one to their cover save. So it's going to be pretty hard for the Orcs in their shoot in turn to remove that blob from that one. Uh, and that's it. We'll come back to the Orcs, uh, to the Space Force shooting uh, psychic phase next. Storm of Stormcaller is the psychic power, which is a Walk Charge 8, and if she gets it, manifested everything in six inches gets to be in cover so roy dice and let's see if you need an eight or more you can re-roll the two if you want you get it off that's cost you an extra command point you also use the stratagem which is called Cloaked by the storm, and everything is minus within six inches of him is minus one to hit. Going into space war shooting phase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Jasmine's shooting phase, she's going to shoot the eliminators into the all core boss. To try and get rid of him. Uh, Two dice, huh? Three dice. You get three dice. You're hitting on threes. No. No hits. Right. So we, these get the and the suppression. So the gun for three attacks. For one of the smasher guns. Three six attacks. So you get again hitting on threes.
Bon mist. Right, so then what you do is it's strength seven, toughness five. So then freeze again, you get two through. So I need to make two, two five up in, in, in vulnerable saves. and they're two damage a piece so nope so he takes four wounds will be the infiltrators so they're going to be firing the first lot are going to be firing at the grots, orange grots, and that they're going to have one shot each, so that's five shots. Hitting on, hitting on three. So one, two, three. They're not in range of for any rerolls. Strength four, toughness two, so wounding on twos, three wounds. Uh, I need five ups. For me, I'll say one, two die. So, and that's the same with the second squad. So, you get five. Five shots. Freeze up, freeze in. Yep. Three more. Two saved, one dies. So that's three dead. They will have to make another hour trip. Now you'll, uh, now these are going to fire in, into two, two separate units. First shot's going into, let me, let me measure, make sure you're in range. Yeah, you're not in range with that one, which is a shame. Could have killed it off. So you're going to fire at that one and that one. Uh, that one. So, so you're going to fire at these two. So you've got 20 shots on the first smash of gun. You can just sit by and we're in intercessors. You play two stratagems to give you take your down to eight command points and you're hitting on freeze any ones you can re-roll that don't count does it two two's missed yeah so i'm gonna save put them over there three one the one two made it Right, then now these are strength four, so you're hitting on fives, you're wounding on fives. So one, two, two three, four, five, six. So I need two, to make four, six, two, six. Right, so that first one I need to make. Oh, two. I've got another one. All right, seven, so. So yeah, seven, I need to make seven, yeah. I need to make seven, five up. And then one. One, which kills that. Again on for the other one, four, yeah. For the next one, yeah. Twenty again, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, eight. 
14, 16, 16, 18, 20. Oh, I'll re roll the ones, Connor. Yeah. So, get rid of the twos because they don't count. You just said threes, didn't you? One, yeah, ones. Nope. Right, so now all you so. need fives. So I've got four. Four. Two safe, so it takes two rooms. Which puts it on to four. So that leaves B three to fire, with which are the insectors. That's it, and now I'll probably fire at the same thing. Picking dice on the inceptors. More do I need? You need to hit on threes. Threes. Or to really roll the ones, can I? Uh, not for them, you can't. Oh, okay. So, twos and ones come out. Yeah, twos and ones come out. Now you need fours. So four again. Yep. I need, I've got four left, so I need at least one five up in bowl. I get one five up, so he's left on one wound. That. It's the end of a space wash shooting and they can't charge so into orcs. I, uh, grots, they lost three leadership for <laughs> There's one left on there. But that's. I didn't lose the whole squad, so that's a little lucky. Uh, straight into Orcs movement phase. Orcs movement phase. As you can see, they have just moved and advanced out of their deployment zone slightly, uh, covering their objectives as best they can and to push back the chances of the Space Wolves Terminators jumping in and getting into the, their meaty stuff. They're also there to try and slow down the uh, Space Wolves cavalry and wolf and and uh, getting into the meaty units as well. Uh, possible charge over there into the inceptors. Uh, just, just in case. It'll be space wolves. Psychic phase coming straight up. Going to cast wall path on the wall boss. Well, the wall boss has got the biggest boss strap. It goes off, he takes the perils, let's see, he takes three wounds, <laughs> ouch. Now we'll cast the jump. And it goes off on an 11, which is good, so we all boys. No, he's not going to. 
to jump. If you understand where you're at, Joe, because I, I don't need to move just yet. On to the third two. one, which will be going into the suppressors. You get, you get three shots. On the re roll, so re roll ones because of the drop sub culture. It's one hit, one hit through wounds on the inceptors. Wound, so one inceptor dead. Next one, same unit. Two shots. Two go through. One wound. One dies, leaves a sergeant. Fifth one goes into Inceptors as well, one wound, well, one, one hit, it's one wound, kills the sergeant. That gives me the back three, which will target. Intercessors, so we're going into the intercessors. First one, two shots hitting on fires because of the cloak by the storm. No hits. Second one, two hit, two two shots hit needing fires, re-rolling ones because of the, no hits. Last one, one shot. No on that. So now going into the looters, they're gonna the spanners in there with the clever spanner, so you get to choose roll two dice and pick the highest for the number of shots. So that's 28 shots, more Daka Daka on them. Intercessors, so fives and sixes produce more extra hits. Being bad moves and we roll ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-eight. So twenty-eight shots going into Intercessors hitting on fives and sixes, re rolling ones. So I've got one, two, three, four ones. Anything that's not a five and six comes out.
So I've got three, four, five, six. Well, two, four, six, eight, ten there. See you if I get any extra. I'll get an extra two, so that's twelve. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 14, two, two, two extra re rolls from the ones because of bad moon's trait. And then it's strength seven, toughness. So we're wounding on threes. Ouch, you really want that. So Jasmine, two, four, six. You need eight, eight saves at three up. Because it's minus one, which would put you at four up. But you got the cover save from the room priest, which puts you to three up. How many do you miss? Just the one. So one of them. One of them dies. I'm gonna redo that with them for some more. Spend some more command points and get them to the shoot again. Just try and think. So this time I get 42 shots. Still, still in play. So these are going to be. Hitting on fives and, and sixes, fives and sixes, generating extra hits and ones re rolled because it's bad moons. Not many ones this time, but a little. This time I've got two, four, six, eight, ten, fourteen. Fifteen. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Hitting on fives and sixes. With ones re rolling because it's bad moons. Nothing extra. So, on them. So, I now need freeze. Eleven this time, Jazz. Eleven free up saves needed. Oh, that means 
to you? Yeah. All did need? Freeze. So two, three, four. So I will need to make a morale check at the end of the phase, but hopefully that's not going to be too difficult for them. Going into my Sagmex, my shock attack guns. Uh, first shock attack gun is, let's see what strength it is. Strength nine. Going straight into the Thunder Wolf Cavalry. How many shots? Four. They're going to be needing sixes. Re rolling ones, get two sixes. Two extra shots for, for the. And no. So, strength nine, toughness. So, freeze. No wounds. Second sh shock attack gun. Same target. Ooh, do I really? No, I won't. Number of shots. Nine shots this time. Again, hitting on sixes. Because of the uh, Rune Priest power. No sixes. And that's the end of the orc shooting. Do, coming back for charge. Because he's in crater, it would be minus two to my charge. It's not worth me charging. We're going straight over into the space walls. Ten. Two. The space walls. Moved up, the orphan advanced. Uh, Thunder Wolf Cavalry should be back there actually because I couldn't have done that because I advanced. So he didn't lose the wound and I thought I didn't lose any of them either. So that was fine. Uh, they moved up there and ready for charges next turn, hoping to get into those vehicles. Uh, shot it. Another tank cleared some gots, but we've got managed to pass them around and they're still hang, hanging on for dear life in that little place. Uh, didn't the eliminators hit and wounded the uh, war boss, but couldn't uh, reach full up in while we saved both, both wounds. Uh, Otherwise, he could have been dead. Uh, and that's, that's it, really. It's the interwalk's turn. Two. So, orcs. Orcs turn. Two. They uh, moved up over there just edging out that screen to stop the ter terminators who are coming in next this turn uh 
in they saw off some in infiltrators the space force the thunder wolves the eliminators and a unit of blood claws over in the back over there my war boss did that uh, I left two intercessors there they won't fail their morale anyway uh, and scored three points that turn be a little easier on me in terms of shooting things because there'll be no minus one to hit on them anymore but I am going to have a load of melee specialists in my face quite soon and uh, it will be where I can slow them up enough to shoot to shoot them this turn and keep them away from my guns and just shoot shoot them off the board. So we'll go into space walks turn three and come back. Space Every minute turn. moved up uh, the the infiltrators and the Intercessor stayed there. Uh, the Terminators came on down over there. Arjak decided to go after my war boss, which is over there. He, he's over there, behind, behind that hill. Uh, they all, all failed their charges. Uh, the Wolf and made theirs, and so did the Rune Priest, and they'll, they'll, they've got rid of about 20 models between them. Uh, I won't have to make a save on that squad over there because they're rumours. Uh, at the end of that phase, Space Wars scored two points uh, into Orc's turn. Three. And we'll see how we go. No, she's not there, she's living by a foot. I think I've got a and I'm not doing any more. So, twos are misses. So, it's Orc turn three, and to jump over here and try and charge Ragnar. Uh, uh, my war boss charged into those left one level. Just moved, fell back, shot out the wolf and, and two terminators there. Uh, space walls are looking a bit thin on the ground. It's currently 10 to 8 going into space walls turn 4. Seeing what happens. Space walls turn 4 and it did a little bit of damage but not much and it's now going into uh, Arjak died to the war boss who uh, lo lost three wounds to, to Arjak you know, it's not too bad uh, we're just going to try and hold out and shoot everything off the board now. Uh, going to fall back with the, the boys and try and get to a position where I'm uh, can shoot everything off the board. That's the idea. We'll see if that happens. End of Orcs turn four, and all that's left is that single Terminator there. Uh, he'll probably charge into those Orcs and try and kill some and then see what happens in return. Uh, but 
hasn't scored any points this turn. So at the moment, it is 15 8 to the uh, Orcs going into turn. Orcs turn. Going into Orcs turn 5, it's 15 8. And oh, uh, uh, Orcs turn uh, and Space Force turn 5, it's 15 8, and we'll see how it goes. Turn five, he charged and didn't do anything. He's lost a rune in return. He's got two left. Uh, Orcs will fall back, shoot, shoot him off the table, and we'll see where and we Space Wolves are white. We're just going to check with the Space Wolves player to, to roll to see if there's an extra round. Oh, there they are. I can zoom in then. Yeah, it goes into a round six, which means I'll score another six points, which is 26. To eight, I'll roll the dice to see if it goes into a round seven. And where is that gone? It does uh, another six, it's 30, 33 to eight in the end to, to Orcs. It was unlucky we were two extra 12 points in the last two rounds, but that's the way it goes. Uh, it was close to round four, but once I, I was able to, uh, to just shoot into all the little tiny bits and get rid of it, it, it sort of put my pay to the game. I'll come back to for the summary in a second. And uh, let's summarise. Space Force run out of steam around about turn three. Uh, all right. Uh, my walk, my big shot attack gun. He, he he put the work in on turn three, got rid of the wolf, and that left the terminators. And I took two terminators out with with a couple other bits. And then it was just chipping away at the terminators, all wrapping the characters. And I did that. And turn five, turn five, I wiped everything, and we rolled for the extra two turns. And that's. Good. That's an, and I got the extra two turns, that's an extra 12 points for me at the end of the two turns. Uh, it was a bit unlucky because uh, Ulrich hit my ball box with everything and wounded with everything. Uh, but uh, he failed one save. One, one involved, vulnerable save he, he failed and only did three damage and that pretty much and then Warbox hit him back and killed him uh, he made a valiant charge with all his characters into my orcs didn't do enough damage to wipe them uh, they fell back and just allowed to shoot all the characters off the table and all the remaining two terminators and in the last two rounds and that that was it and we rolled for round six and round seven I got the extra rounds it went roughly how I saw, saw it going I mean You'll see through the game how I moved and I was screening, dropping back, screening, uh, dropping back out of the fight just to, just to slow them down and allow my, my, shoot, my, my shooting elements to, to think I had to get rid of all his sh shooting and, and, and I, I, mean, I did, I mean, having a look. Space Force with those intercessors, and that's to that strat with the two strats with the intercessors, having them stationary 40 shots. They're pretty damn tasty, and you put them with something out. There's a list there, I mean, that list we were just trying a few bits out, and, and well, unfortunately, we only got to try the intercessors out. Oh. 
was pretty nasty. They were roll, hitting on threes, 40 shots, hitting on threes, re-rolling ones. And, and then you were, that first round, first test, and then wounding on fours. That's a hell of a lot of size. She, she, she took out two of my met guns like that. So they're, they're pretty useful. Uh, uh, I mean, I don't know what, it, it, it just, there wasn't enough there for me. I had too many models in the end, and that, that, that counted. It, I didn't use the boy, boys as aggressively as I would usually, they were there just screening their screens, and that worked. I was able to just sit and take the weather of the storm and then block out the uh, ter terminators, stop them getting anywhere near my guns and bits. Took out a shooting and that, that one when you're going then it was just a case of dropping the screen back so that her, her specialised media units weren't going to get to my guns. I couldn't get. I couldn't get them to. I was never going to wipe those units out in melee. I mean, they got the three plus involve and the boys aren't a specialised melee unit, unfortunately. They, they, they suck. <laughs> I mean, it, it, I think I had 30 attacks and left two blood claws. So that, and, and blood claws aren't really a special you. That, that, so it shows you where whereabouts they are in melee, really. Now, I'm happy with the win. I, I'm happy that we got to show you some of the saga of the wolf. That list I've got isn't perfect by any means, but I've seen how I can go second then weather the, weather the storm. I, I don't know against this with more decker, but I think I've got enough enough firepower in there. But if I can get rid of the opponent's firepower, main firepower, I can then chip away and, and, and just stop stop them from winning. Against another forward army, it's going to be difficult. It'll be, be just chipping away, chipping away, and and seeing where, where we get, but. That's for another time. Uh, I've got a mate who's building a tour in the and that's 200 odd more plus model, so that'll be an interesting game. I, I know how I want to play, play against that, but it's whether I'm able to and whether he allows me to. It'll, it'll be interesting. Uh, that's it for now. If you, if you liked the game and the battle report and want to see more, please. Click the look, like, share, and subscribe button, and hit the bell button to stay up to date with. Thank you for watching. If you've been have enjoyed, please hit the like button, press the subscribe button, and hit the bell button to stay up to date with all my content. Also, feel free to share anything you've enjoyed. Remember, everybody knows the dice are loaded.